you know, I was blessed with punching power. So, you know, you got to be born with it or you ain't born with it. And if you're born with it, you got to use it well. Right? Me, basically me, I earned my way to the top. You know what I'm saying? The things that they thought I couldn't do, I did. And I earned my my, my own self. Nobody took me there but me and God. You know, I thought my career was over at some point, but I see now, you know, my niece, you know, came down with this cancer illness, and uh, I'm just trying to get involved in raising that and trying to get my career on. This, this is where I grew up, um, Patterson Projects. I was like a, um, a former gang member around here, around this area in the Bronx. And um, I, I started to, you know, as things was getting worse and worse, my sister and my, my cousin took me out of the gang, brought me to the gym, and they said, yo, you think you know you bad? You know, this is bad, you stay here. You know, you train and you can travel, you can do things. I just stayed with boxing and took that up and started to like really work hard towards that. You know, I had my share of crazy stuff, but it got me off of the, the street from, from doing a much more crazy stuff. You know, I achieved what I was put out to achieve. I won four titles and and I was, I was, I was happy than that. You know, I, I, I did that. I achieved that. But as far as achieving like the, the money statue, I just messed up on the end on that part. And the money that I did have, I tried to invest it a little, but I messed up a little and it didn't come out right. So, well, my financial situation is is, is rough. You know, I, I went through stuff that I thought I never would go through. You know. I got, you know, I got put out of one apartment, and but I, I have to take the blame for that part sometime, you know. But I never got that real big money where you could say, I'm gonna put a million here, I'm gonna put two million here, or something like that. I, I didn't get that kind of money. But I handled it well as best as I could, you know. I, I bought the building, I, I, I bought a car wash. Everything went under at that time, so I just, like, I tried. You know, I tried and I made a little something and then it lost a lot. So all of it was an experience and a learning lesson and taught me better and got me wiser. Everybody thought I was done and everybody felt that I was done. But you know, I mean, boxing is in me and it was, it was a way of doing what you have to do. I'm the fighter, y'all. I know what I can do and what I can't do. I never stopped training since the '80s and '90s, since Bob Arum like put me on the shelf. So I just kept training. I keep training now. But everybody is, is for them to say they don't know who I got inside of me or what I could do, or how much I got left. So I know what I must do and what I want to do. So this is my life.